Hello, welcome to Tai Chi Exercises with Rosalind. I've got a beautiful sequence for you today called Lotus that was taught to me by my very good friends June and Jeff Williams who live in Australia. And I've adapted it slightly from the version they taught me so that if you have any problems it does involve bending when we there's one move called press the earth and if you have any problems and you're anxious about bending maybe you have balance isn't as good or you suffer with some dizziness or you maybe have osteoporosis and you've been told to avoid forward bending of the back then just this move will be this sequence will be great for you because I've left it out but again Tai Chi isn't competitive so if you've any worries you don't have to do it. If your balance is at all poor, you can bring a chair along and use that. Again, the lightest touch if you can, because Tai Chi is all about relaxation. I just wanted to explain one of the moves that can be quite difficult if to learn facing me. I'll give you a rear view as well. And that's called Snow Rabbit Digs the Earth. And it looks like this. Very like the move we've done earlier called presenting the peach. But it can be tricky. So if you watch me now and you have the rear view, that should make it very easy. Once you've got it, it's, it's fine. So we start with the wrists crossed. And remembering our Tai Chi principles, the body is going to sink. And then the fingers are coming in towards the body. The wrists stay as connected as they can. And then as the body lifts, the wrists separate and the hands come apart. Let's have another couple of goes. So we put the wrist on top. It doesn't really matter, but I'll start with the It'll be your left wrist on top and the hands, body sinks and the hands come down. They point in towards the body and allow the wrists to rotate around just like we're presenting a peach. Now, when I heard that for years I was doing that move and I thought, what on earth? Why are they calling it a snow rabbit? And then I taught the move to a class with people who had learning difficulties and I just put my hands up and they went oh yes there's a rabbit there's a rabbit and I thought oh yes so there is so it was uh, very enlightening for me okay if you're ready let's begin let's start by reviewing the names of the moves that I've explained in the seated version Starting with wave hands in the air. Turtle treads water. The new move, snow rabbit digs the earth. Fair maiden sprinkles the water down the lotus flower and this point release the shoulders release the elbows have very soft fists as though you're holding a bird's egg in your palm then the lotus flower blossoms and we're going to turn and face the wind face the east face the west Lift the sky, press the earth. White stalk spreads its wings. Into snow rabbit again. Waving hands in the air to the finish. Wonderful, really good. So let's do that a couple of times. The first time I'll do that 
with the lifting and sinking and I'll talk through the moves and then we'll do it quietly and see if you can follow and remember the moves that way. Before we start, as always, really important, best possible posture, crown suspended, nice long line at the front, feet shoulder width apart, natural breath, just breathe at your own rate, soles of the feet flat on the floor, though we do get go up in um, the lotus flower blossoming, and a nice calm mind, that place where we're just about to go to sleep. Although when you're learning, you will need to be pretty alert. The calm, calmness comes when you're more familiar with the moves. So we start in horse stance, and remember, one part of the body moves, the whole body moves, every part moves. So we're going to relax ankles, knees, hips, the lower back opens, the lower body has fallen, the upper body is on top. And we lift up to wave hands in the air, and then we just let the body fall, keeping the alignment. We move into turtle, so lifting again, turtle swims in the ocean, and coming out, sinking again, lifting up, snow rabbit plows the earth, and lifting up again, fair maiden scooping the water, down we go, releasing the whole body falling, lotus flower having the water trickling down it, then we come up again, opening out, lotus flower blossoms, sinking and filling the body, face the wind, face the east, face the west, lifting up, lift the sky, press the earth. This is the one where we could bend down, but I've changed that. White stalk stretching up and almost up and down at the same time, spreads its wings. The other side, back to the middle, snow rabbit, up and down, and waving hands in the air, and down again into horse stance for the finish. Great, well done. So let's try it again. This time I'll go through the names of the moves and then we'll, I think we can do it another time silently. We'll see how we go. Wave hands in the air. Turtle swims in the ocean. No rabbit plows the earth. Fair maiden sprinkles the water. Down the lotus flower. Lotus flower blossoms. Turn with the center. Face the east. Face the west. Lift the sky, press the earth. White stalk spreads its wings. Back into the snow rabbits. Wave hands in the air. Lovely. And the final time, quietly. Really see if you can focus into the movements and sensations of the body and enjoy.
fantastic! Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please press the thumbs up button. If you have any comments or suggestions for future videos, please leave them below. Do look below for details of my website and the courses I teach to allied health professionals across the UK. Please subscribe to my button, my channel, the red, big red button rushing there, sorry. I hope to see you again soon. Happy Tai Chi.